What's going on trainers today? We're going to talk about whether or not you should be making an alt account in Pokemon Go. And now, before, before, just really quick, before y'all get all mad at me for talking about it, making more Pokemon Go when we're all mad at Niantic, this is just for the people who want the information. I spent a lot of time before this, even this whole Niantic thing was a thing, looking and trying to find videos and people's experiences with alt accounts. I could never find a video that satiated my desire for the information that I wanted. That basically means I was left unhappy. So here I am. I made my own alt account. As you can see, I'll put it up on the screen. And we're going to talk about my experience. Now, this is my alt account. Uh, you can see it is. Oh, nice. My friend caught a shiny Dialga. You can see it's called Ray MK2. My primary is Ray MX3. If you get the reference, comment down below. Let me know. Take a guess. If you can get it, I will. My mind will be blown. Should you make an alternate account in Pokemon Go? We're going to cover the pros. We're going to cover the cons. We're going to cover my experience. And I'm ultimately, I'm going to leave the decision up to you. But this is what I got. Let's get into it. So, should you make an alt account? I do have notes here. So, if I'm looking down, that's why. My main idea here, if you just want to know yes, no, my answer is yes, you should. There's no obligation to ever use it. You can make it and you literally never log on and it literally doesn't matter. But if you do log on, if you do use it, it makes your main account much more powerful. It allows you to play more Pokemon Go. And overall, I 100% think it does and will enhance your experience in Pokemon Go. And side note, if you're going to be playing less Pokemon Go, this is another way for you, an alt account, it allows you to play more Pokemon Go without spending money. It just allows you to continue to play. Here we go. My experience is I made my alt account on Squirtle's Spotlight Hour, which I believe was July 20th. It's currently August 4th. So I've had my account for two, two and a half, maybe three weeks. Not entirely sure, but that's that's the timeline here. I currently am level 23. I have brought this out for one or two grind sessions. I really only use it during raid hour, to be honest with you, and then for training. Now, I do not currently have a gotcha or a auto ca catcher, capture, auto catcher that can connect to two devices. Once I do, I will be using my alt account a lot more, hooking the, the auto catcher up to my, my primary and my alt and just letting it run. But this is without, this is without an auto catcher. This is me just scratching the surface of an alt account and I'm already recommending it. I'm already thinking it's a great investment for anyone who likes Pokemon Go. So you can see here, level 23, like I said, not a lot of playing, but it's been so fun. Let me tell you, this is one of the biggest pros here for me. And I think it will be for you too. One of the biggest pros is you get to experience Pokemon Go all over again. You get to enjoy finding new Pokemon, filling out your Pokedex and, and reliving the experience of being a new trainer again. And you don't get that with one account. You, Frankly, you have to make a new account every time you want to do it. Having an alt account is a great way to do that. The other thing is, is you get to solo raids by yourself. And I say that lightly, solo. Your alt and your main, throw it together. And there you go. You can solo, you know, tier three raids super easily. I have a note here that says twice the loving, twice the Pokemon, twice the fun. I think that speaks for itself. 100% true. A Another thing about having an alt account that's awesome that I think a lot of people overlook, it really helps getting platinum badges. It helps getting your trade with friends, raiding with friends, winning raids with friends, total trade distance, and total trades. Like, it's, it's, it, there's so many platinum badges that really it helps you get just by trading. And I think that's also another great part about alt accounts is you can just sit there and trade yourself. And sometimes you get a lucky and sometimes you get a, 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 a pretty good lucky and sometimes that lucky becomes your buddy that you grind out so uh, there's no loss you you know it's great things only can happen with an alt account you know so i do really think an alt account has more pros than it does cons i think if you were to make an alt account and hate it and never use it that's fine but i think you're gonna end up using it i think you're gonna end up diving pretty deep into it to be honest with you but but with all that being said let's hop into the cons the things i think an alt account is not good for the first thing is here and i'm the kind of person where i like to focus on one thing i like to have one account i have one activision account i have one google account well not anymore i have 
you know, one, I've always had the same Instagram, the same Twitter, the same everything. I'm a one account kind of guy. And so having two accounts, having to manage two accounts, having to have two phones, I don't enjoy that as much. And I enjoy the grind. I don't mean to say I don't enjoy having two phones, but me knowing me is having to manage two accounts. It's it's a little out of my comfort zone to be just brutally honest, but that's fine. The, the fun outweighs the cons by a very big margin. Uh, the other side is do you prioritize the main or the old? Obviously the main, but there's been times where I've, I've sat there and I've been with both phones. I want to go out and play. I don't have the auto catcher. Which, which one do I want to use? Which account do I want to go out and grind? Every time I've chosen my main because it's my main and I'm not yet level 50. But I can see that for some people, especially when you first make the account, having such a good time, just leveling up super fast, catching all the new Pokemon, the whole experience, it might distract you from your main account. And that's fine if it does, 100% fine. But if you're the kind of person like me who's just been grinding for 50, then you make an ult and you just drop it because you get more of that serotonin boost from the alt account, that could get in the way of your main Pokemon account. And I think a very important point here with alt accounts is your main account should stay your main account. It is, it's, it, it's your main account, you know? All that being said, all that being said, I love having an alt account, and I think you will too. I think you should make one. You have nothing to lose, except maybe some time, but hey, fingers crossed we got a lot of it. So I, I encourage you to, tonight while you're watching TV, set up a secondary Google account, throw up that alt account, and give it a week. You know, I made mine on a whim. I think it's been a great experience. It has only enhanced my experience rating, I said, became easier. Trading has become easier. I've gotten more luckies. I have not found a con or a negative side effect of having a secondary Pokemon Go account that makes me think you should not have one. But I have found so, 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 so many positives and pluses that I, I think Everyone should give it a try. That being said, thank you for checking out this video. Thank you for hanging out. If you found it useful, helpful, informative, any of the above, please feel free to drop a like. I'd appreciate it. To all the new subscribers, to everyone who's been checking out my content, my channel, I appreciate you and I thank you. Before we wrap up this video, I'm gonna do the one thing I like to do the most and that's power my Pokemon. So that's what we're gonna do. Let's see if I can do this. Ooh, do we wanna do this? Should we do this? I haven't even evolved it yet. Let's do it. Boom. All right. All I got to do is just walk them around a bit more and we'll have all that candy back in no time. I'm not stressing. I'm not sweating. I hope you have a great night, day, morning, afternoon, midnight snack, whatever you're doing right now. And I'll see you on the next one. Got a lot of cool videos brewing. So again, Thanks for being here, and I'll see you on the next one. Later!